Before we start tonight's episode, I'd like to give a special thanks to Toys and Things in Danvers, Massachusetts. Toys and Things is a great local hobby store in the city of Danvers. If you are within the area, I highly recommend that you stop by. You are listening to The Broken Lords Podcast. You go down the spiral staircase. The scarecase. The scarecase. <laughs> Sorry, I'm forgetting my own lore. <laughs> oh, oh lord. And you guys keep it keeps spiraling for a little bit. Um and you find yourself at the foot of the staircase. Scarecase. <laughs> I call myself again. I love it. <laughs> um and you notice that's a very open area well, I mean, dark vision. And uh it's a it's a fairly open area, tiled um with like square like patterns um like white well you can't really tell coloring but you know one is uh, significantly lighter than the other one which is in the uh, center concentric squares basically that's the pattern uh onwards into into infinity very fine masonry um the must in this room is pretty pungent um, you notice some spider webs in the corner. Um, nothing really overtly spooky. It's just like it. Even when they try to keep up appearances, it's still like this place gets really dank, really fast. Um, there are a couple of doors at the opposite end. Um, one goes straight. One leads to the right, and it's in the upper right-hand corner. Uh, I'll take the upper. I'm gonna check out the upper right-hand corner area first. I'm okay. Check the other door. All right. Um, so, I... so you guys do that. Roll me perception checks. Wait, I can't see. Is that yeah? Is it just for the guys checking out the doors, right? Right. Yeah. Anyone that can see. Fourteen. Fourteen. Yeah. Same. Jinx. Um. I have somebody you, a cook. You. Me. <laughs> you look at the door. It Stay looks. Like it's, it looks like it's reinforced from the outside, or rather. You guys, so where, so like where I'm standing, is it reinforced or is it yeah. reinforced on the opposite? It's, side? It swings outwards, okay. so the hinges are on the opposite side. Okay. Uh, same for yours. Um, you don't notice that bell trap on this side of the door. Who knows if it's on the other side of the door? Well, you said it opens towards us, right? No, it, it flies out. Oh, okay. Take that as you will. Uh, same handle that you use to open this the door upstairs. Hmm. Um, I'm gonna check the rest of it. Um, you look at the rest of the reinforced door. Uh, it's a reinforced door. There's mm. a central, like, supporting beam that kind of crosses midsection to kind of keep the rest of the wood in place. Um, looks like there's a little bit of an engraving on the top corner of it. It's the same symbol that is the Town of Hearth. Oh. And you don't see any magic trap? I don't see magic traps. I only see magically obscured doors. Oh, okay. Uh, it is not um, magically obscured. It looks fairly mundane in every way, shape, and form. Right, I'm gonna test the the handle. Uh, okay, you do that. Uh, the door starts to creak open. All right, I'm gonna be checking up to see if there's anything up top for the bell. Okay. Uh, what's your passive? Fifteen. Yeah, uh, yeah. You notice the bell on the other side. All right, bells on on the on the outside. Yeah, probably same on this one then. Mm-hmm. mm-hmm. Gonna again go up there, get that clapper. All right, roll me that thieves' tools check or whatever you use to sabotage. Uh, probably thieves' tool. Stanley, remember you only need to be able to see it. Oh, because you can do the range ledger domain. That's true. Yeah, there you go. You do that. Awesome. Mage hand comes up. Click, 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 click. Trap disabled. Hey, can you do that on my end too? Oh yeah. <laughs> click, 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 click. Trap disabled. Hooray! You have done it. Hmm. Yeah, so these are... Man. <laughs> Here I am thinking I'm making big plays with my cool bat cloak, and I'm just watching. <laughs> All oh, I'm watching and unable to see. Yeah, it's really frustrating. 
you what feel you that same familiar chill kind of go past your shoulder. Well, now I still I still have that. I don't think it's been, it hasn't been ten minutes, right? Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah. So like I still have the vision up. So I look around. You see that same spectral trail, kind of. But I don't see a specter on it. No, it's kind of like if a, if a ghost trail happened mm-hmm. and like left it, but there's no ghost. So it, it's more like a like a like a jet stream more so because it's yeah. just there. It's like a supernatural jet stream. So, well, so, so since I'm observing it actually happening now, mm-hmm. I can see the front end of the trail as it's moving along. Yep. It looks, so it looks so like... that would mean that it's not a ghost or an unseen servant because I'd be able to see that. Mm-hmm. All right. So with that knowledge, can I try an Arcana check again? Sure. Twenty-five. It appears to be some kind of arcane mark or a magical tracer. All right. So somebody's getting a message that we're coming. Yes. All right. So I am going to relay that. Um, there is some sort of magical trap. It, it is alerting someone to our presence. Shit. I didn't do it this time. Nah. No, nah, I didn't. Aha! No. Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. I might have a way out of this. One second. Mm-hmm. Do, you, do you happen to have, like, dispel magic? I do have a dispel. Actually, that is literally what I have. Not that I mean, must be nice they've gotten the alert already, but it will be useful well, for them to not. The alert <laughs> while we were coming down the stairs. Mm. We don't need them to get another alert, an update on our location. Yeah, don't need magic when you. All can't right, so so I'm gonna I'm stuff. gonna throw a point of like where it is. Even yeah. even better, I'm going to um I'm gonna minor image like an arrow. Pointing to where he needs to drop the dispelling burst. Yep. It is dispel. Ow. All right. I knew this would come in handy. <laughs> Spell magic often does. Um, Some good shit. So does detect magic. Which I also have. Enough, that was one I was going to prep before the heist. Hey, homie. <laughs> I got you. I got you. Ripping pepperoni. Utility clerics. Mm-hmm. No healing. I All utility. Too much. I have no idea what's going on. <laughs> you thought too much, thought and you were much. going into a heist with Tom the Simple. <laughs> <laughs> I have to think extra when I'm going into a heist with Tom the Simple. You need to think less. <laughs> Roll me perception, everyone. You, unfortunately... I'm in the dark! Roll me at uh, disadvantage. Oh, okay. At least I'm rolling. 19. Man, I am bad at perception. <laughs> we call this roll of the Tom. <laughs> oh, 13. No, no, 19 and a 2. Jeez. I'll be taking the 2, thank you. Uh, that's a 4. 7. 13. I got a 5, so. 13. Oh, wow. I almost had a 21. <laughs> Foles missing. We're, m- we're missing a guy. I, I mean, knew his incompetence would be our downfall. Or at least his own. Wait. Did your dispel magic dispel him? <laughs> if it was that easy, I would have done it so much longer ago. <laughs> He's still Don't act like you aren't the one who brought him here. And I regret every single moment <laughs> that he was here. Luckily, now the split's only five ways. He still got me, Coat. Oh, that's you? <laughs> <laughs> we'll get you the bestest Coat. <laughs> oh, no. I hope so. I like that Coat. With the 10,000 gold you get from your cut, you can buy a new Coat. Wait. That's a lot less than me. <laughs> you see, wait, so Victor hears the ten thousand gold from the cut. Goes, wait a, yeah, ten thousand gold. You're right, absolutely. Oh my god, <laughs> I only have to be cut. <laughs> It'll be a real shame if Tom the Simple were to walk out on this heist. <laughs> <laughs> Raised an awful lot of alarms if he left. <laughs> <laughs> Tom may not be very observant. I feel like we allow the to cry. split the tank because, like, everyone else would be trying to screw it up. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry, guys. They only gave us 90,000 since we killed people. <laughs> Alright, so, yeah, he's missing. That's weird. That's bad. It's not weird. He's been a fuck up and a failure this whole time. <laughs> Whoa! Yo, yo Whoa. listen, I know. Tell me how you really feel, Corby. <laughs> Good lord. <laughs> well, that was in character. God that damn. Was... Yeah, that was in character. Yeah, I mean, listen, you're, you're right, though. Like, you are right. <laughs> <laughs> Just because you're Sorry, right doesn't Seth. make it nice, <laughs> <Stay free>. okay? <laughs> well, we can either I guess, stand here and ponder where 
he either got jacked or left us in the lurch. We must Pretty press forward. His sign of what happened to him. I don't know. Probably perception. Oh, this time I get better than garbage. Fifteen. Fifteen. Ten. Okay. Five. <laughs> <laughs> it's better than you the last negative perception. No, I had, I'm a disadvantage. I can't fucking see. I'm in the dark. Hey, I also got a five. Nice. So I had to roll a three. You kind of squint. <laughs> I mean, you know. Squint Lower as in die. like focus my eyeballs. <laughs> yes. Uh, I mean you can see very clear well, in grayscale basically. Uh, so do you. Um, you notice that the trail kind of leads upwards after it was dispelled. Yeah. Like at the last second when before he went to snap to go up. It was going it was coming from the stairs. Yep. After, it was like you just slightly in front of you was the mark origin, mm-hmm. and then it kind of went like this. Mm-hmm. And then went up the stairs. Interesting. So. Am I got snatched? I don't know. Hmm. But otherwise, there's no obvious sign of full. Nope. There's no trail of his servant either, huh? Yeah, he's not, his unseen servant isn't still around. Because I'd be able to see that. Gone. Well, we knew this would be a shit show from, like, the jump. But, um, and this, this money's not going to make itself. So I, I just hope he's forward. not ratting us out. Yeah. I tell you he's cool, but... Obviously, he's been lying to me the entire time. So. <laughs> it would be a real shame if we was to have to, I don't know, silence a snitch tonight. You know what? Tom, I never thought I'd say this, but you moved up a spot on my list. <laughs> oh, that's nice. <laughs> Incredible. <laughs> there was like three critical hits. <laughs> I know, right? <laughs> Only dot. three. It might have been more. Yeah, probably. <laughs> dot dot dot. Because I hate you, Tom. He's <laughs> <laughs> among my top five favorite quotes of all time. <laughs> so we should probably press on then. Yeah. Yep. <laughs> which, so which door do you want to go at? Do you want to go at the one in the right corner? The one where you were checking? Not terrible. I really wish I could see. We're not Poor play is done, gentlemen. Should we get to the main Yeah, door? no, we're going. <laughs> yes. We're going now. Okay. We were just deciding on which of the right. doors so, to take. So we're... I'll calm my tits. It's fine. Because I can, sur- I can I search can... for traps at, full, at I normal can speed. I lights. Honestly, at first glance, they might not immediately be suspicious of someone of a group with dancing lights because that's how some of them are walking around. That's true. We would have seconds to take advantage of their surprise, but... I can do damage in seconds. So as it's not in this door, Tails is my door. Mm-hmm. All right, so yeah, since we're we're getting near the bottom floor anyway, we're at the conservatory. Dancing lights is up. Tails it is. Tails. So uh, right, right corner door. Right corner door, you open it. A narrow corridor with cobbled stone on either side serving as the like walls and ceiling of this like kind of claustrophobic hallway that seems to lead deeper into the looks like a not really a maze but like a series of corridors that like go underneath the earth yeah um one of which you assume goes towards the astrolabe slash observatory slash whatever you want to call that library okay Mm. Um, right now it goes narrow and straight, and you notice that there is a figure at the end of the hallway. He's standing kind of still, all right, staring into the distance away from you guys. Is he within 120 feet of us? Oh yeah. What does he look like? Looks like full. Fucking Blair Witch Project us on this one. All right, I'm gonna leave the dancing light with the monk. Mm-hmm. Yay! And like, <laughs> we're gonna roll up. Full, you cool? Oh no 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 no! If, I, I'm, we're gonna get close, and if he says that there's something fishy, I'm knifing this guy. Yeah. We're not taking any chances. Oh. Like, are we? Victor's like loud? eyes like widened <laughs> a little bit because I'm like, wow, we, I put him on. We're not going loud yet. We kind of up the volume a little oh. bit. Oh. <laughs> going from a three to a five. Well, when we need to go to seven, we'll call you. Okay. What about me? <laughs> Wait, the, you have the you have the light. Both of you guys can see. Yeah, both of you guys can see. Just not 120 feet. <laughs> you have like a, I think a 30 or a 60 foot. I can't be a bat in the light. 